All right, this is a proof of concept. This is a uh, new feature I'm working on for Profi. Um, so this one, um, what this is, this is just a test style. Um, but what it's going to do is now using uh, Clash Impact as a function. And what that measures is how hard your Clash actually was. So if you have like a light Clash, it would be able to measure that as opposed to a harder Clash. Um, so right now what's going to happen is every time you hit the blade, this blue section is going to grow for the harder hits and shrink for lighter hits. So if I do kind of a low hit, you'll see it'll move, it'll be light hits, and then harder hits will then fill up the blade more. And, and the reason for this style is just so I can kind of measure um, what it takes to get to the full blade level, because um, you're obviously going to want to adjust your thresholds because this is going to use that clash thre threshold. But the idea is now you can have even more realism to those clash effects, and then this will also be applied to like begin lockup. Um, in that how hard you actually hit is going to allow you to control the size as well as how long the effect lasts. So these are kind of, you know, lower hits. And then when you do a full hit, it's going to light up the full blade. So it can, it can detect how hard that clash actually was. And it's going to measure it and then it's going to apply it to the effect. So this one's just the tester style. And then this is an application of that. So a later clash will be a smaller and it's actually smaller and it actually affects how long the, the duration is so it actually fades out faster if it's a light clash so a harder clash would be a larger area and then it also stays on the blade a little bit longer and then your hardest clash in this one is going to be almost a full blade light up and again it lasts just a little bit longer now they're they're not meant to last super long but the the idea is you can kind of have the little clash effects be small and quick and then the harder ones be larger and longer um, and then it also applies to the lockups and it for this instance it's set up for begin lockup so when you first have that begin lockup hit um, whether in regular mode or in battle mode the size of that lockup area is going to react to that so it'll be kind of a small section and then obviously it goes into lockup and then if I do a larger hit it'll be a much larger impact on the blade um, so I still have a lot of uh, dialing in to do. I've been working with Frederick on it, um, but as a proof of concept, it's working pretty well. Um, it'll obviously be something for a future update, um, but now this new Clash Impact function is going to just bring a little bit more, or even more realism to your effects in that you can actually have the blade react to how hard that hit is. Um, so that, uh, you know, just trying to take it to the next level. So uh, still a lot more work to do on it. Um, but it's, uh, it's working pretty well as a beginning proof of concept, so I'm excited about it, um, but definitely more to come. So uh, talk to you soon.